What's good, my fellow weak motherfuckers? Alright, so I don't know whoever is the person watching this. It's maybe some amateur or maybe some cool guy who just doesn't know how to make his left kick harder. Well, not left kick, leading foot kick. So I got two pretty simple drills to make your leading foot kick stronger. My leading foot is my left. The most thing was my left because of my righty. Back to what I was saying. Those drills can make your leading foot kick harder. You can improve your left foot kicking or right foot and no, whatever your leaning foot is. Martial artists should always practice with the two sides because when it comes to sparring or when it comes to the fight and you just do your back foot kick strong and then coming with your left and you're like Ooh. and that sucks. So the first drill we're having is a foot switching. Pretty easy one. You just have to hop from your back foot over there to your leaning foot, this one. You just do it. You can do it with one, two. Like here you go, one, two. Then you switch and go for your three. You can do for low kick or for anything else. There's also a thing that you can do with a knee. You know that knee cross in the Muay Thai, so go like one, two, then you switch and you go three. Cross to the knee is a pretty nice combo. You should always use it in either your Muay Thai practice or your sparring situations when kickboxing. It's pretty great. Now it's a little Bruce Lee fans moment because we're going to talk about the pendulum kick. The hardest pendulum kick is not the best move because you're losing your balance a lot. Like when you're placing two feet like this close, you're having much less stability. So the dude can kind of suddenly cut the distance from you and do a trip and you just go, Whoa! Is that going to be bad? But back to what I was saying, pendulum kick, how do you do that? You're standing on, a, on your leading foot by having your back foot over there. I like doing the pendulum kick with a little trick, like I'm going to jab, like I just do. So here, let me show you the mechanism. I'm going for the back jab, and at the same time, I'm putting my back foot to my left foot. So it looks like this. And here I'm saying, pulling on my feet. On my back foot, and then I'm going for my powerful side kick like this. Let me show you this full speed. Training for the both sides is very important in martial arts because, as I said before. Your right kick is strong, but your left kick is not. Or your left kick is strong, but your right kick is not. So always train for the both sides. Remember to work out. Maybe I'll do a workout video, I don't know. But I'm doing my karate training. Well, anyways, thank you for watching. I hope this was useful for you. It's Benji here. Follow me. Be masculine. Don't be weak. Good luck, brother.